The ocean is becoming more acidic as we speak. Here's why that is a big deal. You see, our oceans absorb about 30% of the excess carbon dioxide we humans produce. And as the percentage of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere increases, so does the amount of it that gets absorbed by the ocean. This is a good thing, right? Well, not exactly. As the ocean absorbs more and more carbon dioxide, its pH level drops, meaning it's becoming more acidic. And this is a problem because it makes it harder for shells and skeletons of marine organisms like corals and clams to form. It also makes it harder for them to get the minerals they need to grow and repair their t And as you might have guessed, this can have a devastating impact on the entire marine ecosystem, including the fish that we eat. So what can we do to prevent this? Well, for starters, we can reduce our own carbon emissions by transitioning to renewable energy sources like solar and wind power. We can also protect and restore coastal ecosystems like mangroves and seagrass beds, which can help absorb carbon dioxide directly from the atmosphere. By taking these steps, we can help preserve the ocean's delicate balance and protect the amazing creatures that call it home.